today on Artifacts. We take a sneak peek at some masterpieces from one of Paris's largest private museums. Then it's all about patterns in the sand as we delve into the stunning world of sand art. From a fistful of sand arise the outlines of a story. Patterns created by the nimble fingers of sand artist Lawrence Coe. Sand art actually has got a lot to do with um, how you actually control your hand and you can actually use any machines or any tools to actually enhance it further. You have to really know how to, to speak the language of the sand. With every stroke, the sand shifts to reveal a new image. Scenes brought to life purely from Lawrence's imagination. But as soon as a scene is complete, it's destroyed. The sand parting to make way for a new page in the story. Uh, the hardest part about working with sand, I would say, is the impermanence. When you animate a story, you are actually inputting all these uh, emotions and your mind into, into the work. But just like every single story, you know, it always comes to an end. You have to come to an end. Nothing in this world is permanent, so that reflects a lot you know, in sand art as well. So impermanent doesn't have to be uh, a bad thing to me. Which is why I, I see there's the same kind of beauty in sand art, because uh, it is this impermanence that actually allows me to tell many different stories. <laughs> Just love watching, I mean look at that. Yeah, I know. Oh gosh. I mean, I mean, we're, we're of course they're fast forwarding the footage a little yeah, bit so that you so. can see it happen in real time. But pretty cool, you know. Look at ah. that AMI logo. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, there you go. I suppose you you um, have to be able to visualize it inside your head before you actually okay. do it. I mean, that that's got to be I a think strength. They plan it. They do a storyboard. Yeah. They they draw out yeah. each image so they know how the story is going to flow because. Uh, um, Sometimes I guess one picture to link to the next picture mm -hmm. it has to have some yeah. kind of transition, you know. So pretty interesting. Anyway, sad to say that was our final episode of Artifacts for this season though. That means that we're not mm. quite done yet. We'll bring you another <laughs> season when we can. That's right. We hope you've enjoyed all the artwork and the stories that we've brought you over the weeks. Well, you can also catch up, in fact, if you've missed any at our website, channelnewsasia.com slash amlive. Meanwhile, the masterpieces from the first part of today's episode are currently on display at the Art of Collecting exhibition at Singapore's Fort Canning Centre. And the details are on the website on your screen, so do make a visit.